Hello and welcome back. So you can see here I, I went and continued on and I did my dark and light lines on here. On this one here I've done an extreme version where I've gone really thick uh, with a felt pen just to show which ones would be darker and which ones would be lighter. And hopefully you've managed to do the same on one of these. Uh, what I'd like you to do is cam scan in whichever one you decided to do. If you did both that's fantastic. Uh, cam scan them individually and crop them and that would be great. Next up is your pencil sharpener. So what I'd like you to do is use the same skills to pen and ink your pencil sharpener in. But just before you do that um, I just want to pull some attention to this bit here. There's actually a gap here and there's some information missing here along this edge. So one of the things I've done is I've done a slightly diagonal line here to show that the blade here, it's very hard to see, but it is it is diagonal, it comes down like that. But also we want to put in the detail that is along this edge here on the inside of the pencil sharpener and along here. This has got a thickness uh, along here there's a top and a bottom edge so I want to put that in on my drawing so in order to put that in on my drawing I'm going to follow this curve around and go along and round here but I'm just going to come half a square down so half the length down and I'm going to move along here like this and then I'm going to come half a square down here and I'm going to come along around here and to the end here just to add that in and there is a wall that comes down here as well so I am actually going to add that in just down here and then put a small curve at the end just to show you that this is attached underneath and then that finishes my pencil sharpener um, once you've done this and you've inked it in and you've added this little bit of extra bit here um, what I would love you, for you to do is to scan this in the best you can and add it to our online uh, record of online work. Thank you very much. Uh, that's the end of this tutorial. Well, we might come back and do some rendering later on, but for now, that's all. Thank you very much.